Hey there guys, welcome back to another video of all things Apple Plus. I hope you guys are having a great day today. We're going to be doing a jailbreak tutorial. We have the 13.5 jailbreak and as you can see, I'm currently jailbroken. I'm on iOS 13.3 and I wanted to show you guys just a how to update and down actually update to iOS 13.5, which is the newest OS that's out right now, currently at the moment. And we're gonna be jail jailbreaking on my uh, iPhone 11 Pro Max. So I hope you guys just do enjoy this tutorial. If you guys do, please like, comment, subscribe. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump into this. So first thing we're gonna need is a computer. So we cannot do this without a computer and we're gonna be new using the alt store. So let's go ahead and jump right into our computer here. And first and first, First and foremost, we're going to plug in our phone to our computer. So for me, what I like to do is whenever I'm doing any sort of jailbreak or any sort of new jailbreak like such has come out, iOS 13.5, what I like to do is restore my phone and get it you know, fresh and updated. So currently it's on iOS 13.3. What I have done is within yesterday actually, I have updated my phone or I not updated from my phone. I've actually backed up my phone and I've made sure that everything is set and ready to go. That way when I do restore it, I will have all the content that I need back on my PC. So right now what we're currently gonna do is we're gonna restore our phone and it's going to update it to iOS 13.5, which is the correct firmware that we're gonna be at, which is the most up-to-date firmware, which I'm really excited for. So first and foremost, while we're doing this, let's give a really big shout out to Panda Own and let's also give another one to Everything Apple Pro who has pushed out this amazing jailbreak for Memorial Weekend. And I gotta say guys, this is just an amazing jailbreak. So I'm really excited for this. So let's go ahead and hit the restore button. We're not gonna go ahead and back up and we're going to restore and we're going to update. So it's gonna update us to iOS 13.5, the brand new firmware that's currently out right now, which is amazing. And we're gonna go ahead and hit the next button. And then we're gonna go ahead and hit, hit accept. So mind you, again, the only way to do this at the moment right now is via computer. There are There were methods of using uh, App Valley or Ignition uh, to be able to download the application, but currently that's still within the works. Once a, uh, a comp once an actual you know way is able to or a way is able for us to download the actual jailbreak or the uncovered jailbroken or jailbreak app onto our devices, I'll make a tutorial about that later on. So let's go ahead and navigate over to Alt Store, and we are going to download Alt Store for either you can download it for Windows or you can, you can download it for Mac. So currently I have Mac, so we're going to go ahead and download that. And then we're going to make sure that that gets installed onto our device. Now, what we are doing is we're sideloading the alt store onto our device. It's super simple, super easy. Again, while this is loading up, I'm going to go ahead and jam back over to our device and see how we're doing here because we do we definitely need this to be restored before we navigate and before we put the alt store back onto our device. So. We're gonna go ahead and let that restore. So as you can see, we're in the restore process. There is, we still have a little bit of a ways to go. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna wait for this guy to go ahead and restore. It does take a minute to, to do this, but I, just for me and just for how I operate with my own devices, I personally would like to restore and update and then load everything back on as I would. So. Currently, we've already restored our devices. We're gonna go ahead and go through the whole setup process. So I'm gonna go ahead and skip through uh, most of the sensitive uh, material back. So I'm gonna go ahead and skip actually just a little bit. And we're gonna go ahead and wait for our phone to activate. Perfect. So let's go ahead and bypass through everything. We are gonna need your Apple ID. I just wanna get past this moment here. And let's go ahead and get back into our phone. So now we have a fresh, brand new restored iPhone 11 Pro Max on iOS 13.5. Through this, what we're gonna, actually let me go ahead and show you real quick, that under general, let's go ahead and hit up about. We are on, let me focus this real quick. We are on iOS 13.5, again, on our iPhone 11 Pro Max, using the uncovered jailbreak. So I'm, again, super excited for this jailbreak. Now, back to our computer. What we need to do now is that now that we have our phone plugged into our computer, we are also going to make sure that we do trust the uh, allow our computer to trust our phone or have the phone trust the computer, I should say. And we are going to download and install the alt server onto our device. So from here, we're actually going to set up as a brand new device. I'm not going to actually I'm not going to set up as a previous device. I want to do this completely clean for you folks. So now that we have our device all set up, 
We're going to navigate over to the alt store and we're going to initiate it. Awesome. So from here, it's going to make sure that if you do have the alt store installed onto another device, just make sure that you're aware of that. So go ahead and hit the install alt store from the top menu here and we're going to select iPhone. From iPhone, it is going to have us input our user or our Apple ID and our passcode. So make sure that that is signed on to your device. So that way you plug in your username and password correctly and you know accordingly and then go ahead and hit continue. What's going to happen is it's going to sideload the alt store onto your device. So you should see on your device if you get these two uh, options or these the installation successful, you should see the actual alt store on your device at this moment. Now now that we're back onto our device, we can see that the alt store is installed. Now we're going to navigate over into Safari and we are going to download the IPA for the uncovered jailbreak. To do that, we're going to navigate over into the uh, the dev or the uncovered.dev uh, website. But, but actually, before we do that, let's go ahead and trust the alt store. So we're going to navigate over to general, scroll all the way to device management. Go ahead and tap on your email that you used for your Apple ID. Go ahead and hit trust, trust again, and just go ahead and scroll on out. And then you can tap on the alt store icon and it should allow you to open up the application. Perfect. Alt store looks great. Awesome. So what we're going to do again, we're going to navigate over into the uncovered uh, website. That way we can download the actual IPA and then we are going to sideload that using the alt store. So let's go ahead and look up uncover.dev. Perfect. And as you can see, the uncovered jailbreak does work for iOS 13.5. So we're going to download version 5.0 and we're going to hit download one more time. Perfect. And as you can see at the very top right, you'll notice that the download manager shows that it has been completed. So we can go ahead and tap on that. Go ahead and tap on the actual IPA. And here we have the uncovered version 5.0. Let's go ahead and scroll over to the alt store. And from the alt store, we are going to input our username and password, just like as we did with our, or with our Apple ID. So go ahead and plug in your username and password. Then it should allow you to go, it should actually start to install the uncovered jailbreak application onto your phone. So you should have both active on your phone as you can see right here, everything is looks perfect. Now let's go ahead and scroll up and as you'll notice, we do have the uncovered jailbreak app. So from here, we can go ahead and jailbreak as you would. Again, big shout outs to everything Apple Pro, uh, Phone Rebel and Actually, I've, I've actually just purchased one of his cases. I'm probably going to be doing a giveaway with one of his cases. If I, Hopefully, everything goes well with the shipping for his cases, but I'm looking really forward to trying out his new case on my device. So go ahead and hit the OK button if it doesn't work the first time. Your phone should reboot or it should respring. Perfect. Now, if you do have any questions or do if you do get stuck on this part right here, just go ahead and make sure that your phone reboots, come back to the jailbreak app, and then you should be able to launch it and you should be able to jailbreak it again. There we go. Let's go ahead and slide up, scroll over, and then here's the jailbreak app. Let's go ahead and launch that one more time. Perfect. Now everything looks good. It looks almost like we have a zero out of 32 at this time. Let's go ahead and jailbreak the application or jailbreak the device. Perfect. This looks like it's about to take. Awesome. And again, check out phone rebel cases as well too. Probably the one ad I have no problem with at all. So now the jailbreak has fully completed. Let's go ahead and hit the OK button and your phone should reboot at that point. Reboot or even I should actually say respring at that point. Very good. Now we can go ahead and slide up and scroll over and you should see Cydia. Perfect. Now we do have Cydia. So we've officially have a jailbroken phone 
on iOS 13.5, the most latest version of iOS currently out at the moment. So I hope you guys did like this little tutorial. If you guys did, please like, comment, subscribe, check out my other videos on all things Apple Plus. You can go ahead and start downloading and installing uh, your different tweaks through Cydia. If you do have any problems with any of your Cydia tweaks, please let me know in the comment section down below and I'll be more than happy to assist you guys. And again, please let me know if you guys have any questions, concerns, comments, and I'll be more than happy to assist. Again, fully jailbroken on iOS 13.5. This is an amazing feat. Again, big shout outs to all the teams that have worked so hard on this. Thank you guys so much. I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. Peace.